hi to Chaco. We have uh, Blade Master. Oh, the red Blade Master. Did he steal it? He probably stole it. And did he steal the item? I have no idea because I have no Blade Master selected. Uh, red Blade Master is, of course, Lynn's Blade Master. The blue Blade Master is, of course, a nice uh, fly Blade Master. Let's check out these Blade Masters. This Blade Master, he sold an item. A TP, of course. And he bought a circlet earlier. So the item was indeed picked up here by Mr. Red Blade Master, Lynn's Blade Master. Sims of Virginity! Oh, that's a game winning item. Arkinos is just happy with that. Also, he stole the XP. Look, Benzur is still 0 XP. But do we see the opposite happening now? No! Mazur is just a bit too slow. Arkinos is a bit too fast. Or, you know what? Arkinos is gonna win this game. This is looking so good here for Lynn. Flying doesn't stand a chance. Look at his Blade Master. He has 3 less agility. Three less intelligences, which means the Shadow Hunter will later have, have uh, three less intelligence and less XP. Is he going for this level five now? We have a bunny. He's looking. Bunny's looking. Grunt here is being attacked by creeps. Shows Warden power. Romantic's not the top 16. I guess not, but he's amazing. Want to see some human? It's like everyone in my chat just wants to see human. Well, we'll have some more human games uh, later. I'm sure Romantic's playing more games. I'm not sure about Infi. He uh, he might just quit. And uh, I don't know though. He, is he not practicing for GCS? I feel like he should be practicing for GCS. Playing more games. The Blade Master. Go for the Blade Master. Oh, there's a nice and stare on the grunt. This doesn't look good for Mr. Uh, Blue still. Who is still... Uh, it's still fly. Lin is always just... One step ahead. Is he still one step ahead? He is actually behind in XP. We have an info potion now for the blue uh, Blade Master. And he doesn't kill a single grunt, maybe this one. Does any Blade Master have a boots? No, no boots. Uh, but this grunt's going to. Look at these units, all so hurt. They're so hurt. He has the healing salves. Okay, now he heals this grunt and this Blade Master. This grunt. Oh! Did he get XP? How much did he have? He has le less than this Blade Master, right? Now he has more. So yes, he did get XP there. Oh, better Blade Master from uh, Fly. This time he does steal the creep. And now we have a level 2 Blade Master. And this Blade Master is still just level 1. But it's a level 1 Blade Master with more agility though. 29 against 28. So he's super duper strong. Tier 2 being built here in the back. Spirit Lodge. Grunt stuck in his base. Oh, and the base is open! The base is open. Now how come the grunt is stuck in the base if the base is open? I don't understand. Uh, there was a nice cancel on this uh, Spirit Lodge. Meanwhile, Lin just building his beast here and his Spirit Lodge. This game is already over, guys. I'm sorry. All the fly fans in my uh, channel. Our town is under <sighs> this is 0% uh, chance for flying. He's going to tier 3. Oh yeah, this is how he plays. I forgot. This is how he plays. Uh, doesn't build a beast here. He goes to tier 3. But to be honest, he lost with Org Worker uh, against Org Worker with this strategy. So I don't think he's gonna win against uh, Lin with this, especially not when he's already behind. At least his Blade Master is ahead. He got both of the items, both the level 5 items actually. Uh, potion of Invul and a Potion of Greater Mana. Is that gonna win him the game? A fly place is never over. I think it's over, but. Uh, it's not over yet. Okay, you're right. It's not over yet. We have a Shadow Hunter here. Shakti Lar. What Shadow Hunter do we have here? Jojo Headshrinker. Jojo Headshrinker is, of course, a fan favorite. We have Akinos against Mazu. We already mentioned that. Does he not know what's happening? Yes, he knows. Blade Master is definitely in the time. Like this level 7 Bandit Lord. Look how much hit points he still has. 525. Just go for the Shadow Hunter. Does not go for the Shadow Hunter. He goes for the Shadow Hunter. It's a Frog Shadow Hunter now. He has an Info Potion. He's gonna use it at some point to save himself or not. Yes, there it is. And now he's going for this crap, but we have Spirit Link. There is the Spirit Link. And the Hex Blade Master is Shellfish now. We have a uh, Red Shadow Hunter. Is he going to die? Yes, he dies. That's the difference between having that Info Potion and not having that Info Potion. I guess the Info Potion was a difference, but. But the Blade Master super long hit points. 
Uh, is he going to die? Probably not. He uses a mana potion to buy a skull of healing. Yes. And Lin's uh, Shadow Hunter should be back soon, but versus Blade Master might die. He has the info potion though. Did he just buy that? He probably just bought it at the shop. And the Shadow Hunter is so long hit points, but the Blade Master cannot uh, kill him because he's dead himself almost. Doesn't have healing salves. Here comes Blade Master. Do we have a Raider now? We have a Raider for uh, Lin. And remember, no Raiders, no Bestiary for Fly. So uh, this Raider. Oh, he instead to Grunt. Interesting. Upgrade complete. But he can buy the orb now. And can he win with the orb? He has a Spirit Walker, but he's AFK in the back. Does not have gold for the orb. Just buy some uh, mana healing. Ooh, Blade Master here, by the way. Super low health. And he kills the grunt. Oh, ah. Kills the sheep. 43 supply for Lin. Fly at 31, but Fly has the orb now. The orb, but I think Raiders are still better. We saw this earlier against Orc Worker yesterday, actually. A tier 2 Orc Worker against a tier 3 Fly. And that uh, early game went even. Uh, that early game went better for Fly than this game. And Fly lost. This game, he's playing against Lin. We'll see how it goes. Sacrifices Raider for this orb. For the Master Spirit Walkers, at least not yet. They're still initiated even. There's an snare on the grunt. Raiders are just so good against the Spirit Walkers, against the... Uh, Spirit Walkers, sure. Blade Master, Mazur picks up the Tome of Strength. There's not an snare with three Raiders. That's maybe a bit overkill on the Raiders. We have a level 3 Blade Master now for Fly. Of course he picked up two Critical Strike, uh, probably. Come on, pick it, pick it! Grunt goes down. He's a chicken! Chicken Blade Master! Doesn't even have Critical Strike. Okay, he does pick level 2 Critical Strike finally. And now he's gonna kill Raiders. He's Raider going down fast, but Raider first killing the Spirit Walker. Spirit Walker is my coat. We have a little raccoon and we have a frog. We have all these animals. It's like a farm here. Blade Master next to the Blade Master. Blade Master going for the Blade Master, while the Blade Master is going for the Raider. Uh, the raccoon just walking around. The Bla Raider is just fine. He's okay, he died. Uh, Grunt is killing a spirit walker. I've never seen this in my life. Wow, he killed it even. What a missed bike there by uh, Fly. The Blade Master is fine, but we have a TC. And there goes a Grunt. And with the TC, things change. Then still 15 supply up, but he needs to heal. Has a Coda now as well, of course. I think, yeah, instead of the third Raider, if you build a Coda earlier, it would have been better for Lin. He's getting another Kodo. Okay. Blade Master, what is he doing? He's going for the Spirit Walker. Spirit Walker takes so much damage, he's dead. Could have probably gone banished for him, but I don't know. It's a very small time window. There's a healing wave, level 1, of course. Same here at the other side, but we have more mana on this Shadow Hunter. Blade Master, pretty low, though, for both players. He has a healing potion, Mr. Uh, Fly has. Lin has the slippers, though. 159, but stomp, and the Blade Master dies. And Fly. Oh, let's see. Uh, let's see. He could still lose his Blade Master. I'm, I'm sure he can. Look, his Blade Master is low on hit points. The Shadow Hunter uses another healing wave. Who's gonna buy the mercenaries? Who has money for it? The Raider's super low there. Big Michael back. The Spirit Walker taking damage from the Grunt. The Grunt, again, is he going to kill Spirit Walker? There goes one Raider. Here comes a Kodo for Lin. Where, why does it come from the left side? Lin, what, does he have his rally point? Uh, Wrong or something, yes, Spirit Walker there as well. Kodo is being uh, killed by the Blade Master and everything else, of course. Uh, the, sh the Peons and the Grunt, though, killing the Berserker, easy peasy, with the help of the Shadow Hunter. But yeah, Fly, of course, coming back. Like I was saying, never count out Fly. If Fly is playing, the game is never over. Was it me that's playing that? No, it was not me. There was a uh, Who Doubt Pro that was saying that. Banners means ethereal form, just saying. It's so difficult, man. It's like the same thing, but um, I confuse this all the time. I mean, yeah. <laughs> fly, fly plays is never over. Well, um, Lin is still 13 supply up, though. Lin is still 13 supply up, but the hero levels now 
three, three, two, almost level four. And here we have uh, three and three. Okay. If we get if we get level three TC. By the way, we got the best item in the game in this matchup. Scourge Bone Chimes, insane item. He's getting more grunts. He's getting Beast here finally, but not for Raiders. He will get the Kodo and the Kodo upgrade. He's getting Adapt Spirit Walkers. They were still initiate. Are you kidding me? They were still initiate. These Spirit Walkers, of course, Adapt. He's getting more uh, shit. Okay. He's seen ties to Creeps, Kappa. I wouldn't be surprised, but uh, not yet. He's, he, nah, Blade Masters is more likely to die to Creeps. So much mana on the Shadow Hunter, by the way. 480 max plus a mana potion. This this Shadow Hunter just has a 375 without a mana potion. The Blade Master plus three agility though is super strong. This Blade Master only has the orb. The orb is of course better than the agility, but it's uh, comparable. 49 spike and 36. Uh, well, let's see if I can do another amazing comeback still. He needs to keep winning these fights because he, he's not winning them by much. Because of that, he's still behind. Uh, this Spirit Walk uses a speed skull. Kodo is under attack next. Spirit Walkers. Oh, one of them is still alive. The other one's still alive as well, but you know, that one is being focused. Shadow Hunter is surrounded. Can he kill the Shadow Hunter? He has nothing to save it. A Shadow Hunter goes down with the Blade Master here. He's fine. No problem. Mr. Blade Master survives because the uh, Healing Wave is pretty strong. Oh, ethereal. Let's get this. Uh, someone said bone chimes heal as much as healing scroll over the course of the game. Really? I'm not sure who said that. But it's probably not for org mirrors. Depends on the matchup, of course. Uh, we have a uh, nice and snare. This raider, he is uh, taking damage. Well, these units are, are in a different dimension. TC, is he going to die? Yes. Stomp, where's the stomp? There is the stomp, where's the healing wave? There's no healing wave. How can a shadow hunter with so much mana be out of mana? And, uh, well, I don't know how he can be out of mana. Let's uh, let's see this bait master attack once. So it's something. I want to see him attack. Hello, blade master, attack something. He heals like five hit points per attack, and he attacks like uh, what, two hundred times per battle. So that alone is like thousand hit points. I don't know. Uh, this raider is uh, is dead. This Blade Master is, is okay. Let's see, 40 spike at 49. He needs to retreat. I think like uh, five just needs to be uh, a bit more patient. Get 50 supply worth of units instead of fighting with these 40 supply armies or 30 or however a spy this. He did kill two raiders and uh, actually I wasn't paying attention because I was just checking the Blade Master how much he healed for. So I'm, I kind of missed the the bread and butter of this fight. There's another raider there that died. Uh, did we do we have any raiders for this player? No, I guess all the raiders were for. Uh, for Lin, so Lin lost three raiders, and the Kodo was probably Fly's Kodo. And the Blade Master going for the Kodo. Kodo takes so much damage. There's a dispel on uh, the Spirit Walkers. 44 spike is 55. It is 44 better with the TC, with uh, better upgrades, better everything. Actually, the Kodo doesn't have the master upgrade yet, but the Spirit Walkers do. Both players run the shop here. What an interesting uh, play here. There's another healing wave. How much mana does the Shadow Hunter have? Not that much. This Shadow Hunter has all, uh, even less, but he has a healing scroll. There comes another Kodo. Where's that Kodo upgrade? Well, you don't have 50 supply yet, so maybe you don't get it just yet. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, the Blade Master wants his item as well, and it does go to fly, uh, I mean the XP went to fly, I'm not sure the item, the item went to, uh, yeah, it went to fly as well, do we see stomp? No stomp. Oh, now we have a level 3 TC, things now will start to look really good for fly, even though it's behind in supply, unless he loses his Blade Master, of course, that's exactly what it does after I say it's looking good for him, he loses his Blade Master, and uh, suddenly it doesn't look that good anymore for him, <laughs> he's losing his TC as well. 
And maybe his shop will go down next. Oh, the, it's a frog. It's a frog, though. They mash it back, but the frog is, goes down. It's no longer a frog, it's a cow. The cow goes down. Another heating wave. They managed to kill creeps. Uh, oh, a manual of health. That's nice. And make sure that the Skodo cannot escape. You can just creep and just eventually kill the Kodo and the or Orc army of uh, Fly. Fly without the TC. The Shadow Hunter just uh, regenerating mana in the background buys a mana potion. So we mask on Shadow Hunter, of course, amazing. Kodo does go down. This other Kodo is also ensnared. He has uh, still only level 1 or uh, not level 2. Shadow Hunter here is also healing mana. Or actually not. He has a Clarity Potion though. Uh, the Raiders though killing the Kodo very fast. But the Raiders dying to the Blade Master. There's another Raider though. He's creeping. Uh, Kodo goes down. Okay, the Raiders done creeping. There's a snare on the Blade Master. Can he kill the Blade Master again? He has mana for Windwalk. There's only two Raiders. So I don't think he's going to die. Uh, there's a healing wave. Only on the Blade Master. He's, uh, he can use your Windwalk now. Okay, there it is. For the Spike is 43 though. It's now closer than ever before. It's actually, uh, I don't know, I don't understand. Liam was doing great, and now he's behind in supply, what? Or has less big supply advantage? Did he lose too much over here? Like he lost two raiders and a grunt for two kodos. There's like a uh, nice supply for eight. I don't understand the orc mirror, man. Don't ask me. This peon goes down, he's now going for the shop maybe. No, he doesn't even kill the shop. He's like, yeah, you can have a shop here. I have a shop here, you have a shop here, we both have a shop here. No, never mind, he does kill the shop now. Didn't realize maybe it was an opponent's shop. Go for the shop. We're under attack. Hey, Master, almost level 5. Shadow Hunter, almost level 5. Hey! Mount, uh, TC is back. And what about, wait, he's at 43 supply, uh, I guess. Oh, he does get the upgrade now. 700 level four here. Oh, who's gonna get it? The fly again gets it, but the item also went to fly. There's two big items he stole with the blade master. He stole this one and he stole this one. And actually that might make the difference. That might have uh, won't fly the game. This zombie mask of course, insane item that he saw earlier. He also got the scourge bone chimes. Which definitely heals more than a heal scroll of this game. TC comes in and uh, stomp! God, it takes a lot of damage. The Blade Master just uh, cutting apart the Spirit Walker. Look how much damage the Spirit Walker takes. Research complete. Now it's going for this Spirit Walker. And uh, he's still alive. It's going for the Kodo. It's going for the Kodo. 46 Plague is 43. There's a shop here for Lindo, so Lin definitely, uh, well, however, we have the level 3 DC. There goes Kodo. What is this? A baby seal Blade Master, but he's back to being Blade Master. Uh, the Raiders just killing uh, Spirit Walkers, easy peasy of course, but Spirit Walkers can be revived. The, uh, he doesn't revive. There is a revival. The Spirit Walker comes back, maybe go back into corporal form. Uh, maybe the Blade Master is killing this Kodo. This Kodo, if he kills the Kodo, the Kodo have the Kodo or are the level two. So killing the Kodo is 20% gone from the entire army here of Fly. He does kill the Kodo. And Fly is now down to no Kodo aura. But he still has his heroes and uh, two Spirit Walkers. I guess he doesn't have mana for another revival. No, he doesn't. Uh, we see a retreat here. Why do we? Why exactly? I guess um, to heal up. Okay. Spirit Walker is trying to kill the Spirit Walker. The Blade Master going for the Shadow Hunter. The Shadow Hunter out of mana. Maybe it was out of items to buy here. We're under attack. We can buy one Clarity and one mana now. But maybe a second ago the mana was not available. Maybe the clarity, clarity was not available either. So maybe he just bought all the items. So that's why you retreated. Because this Shadow Hunter, 150 mana. Oh, now he's going to kill the shop. Takes revenge for uh, the shop being killed earlier. Shadow Hunter is almost level 5. 41 supply against 46. Uh, 
And what is this? Ring of protection plus three. We're level five shadow hunter now though for Lin. Uh, for fly we have uh, level four, almost level five uh, blade master. But the shadow hunter is still level four. By the way, I think this game is uh, very interesting because we finally see orc mirrors where they don't play the same style. Tier three against tier two. This is such a different matchup. It's almost like we're watching night elf versus uh, human instead of orc versus orc. Here it goes again. 46 of ply against 41. The Shadow Hunter in bad position. Is he going for it? I mean, it's still hard to kill though. You can hex the Blade Master. Oh, and the Stomp and the Healing Potion. But he is uh, hex, dispels it. And they use the Healing Potion, of course, and gets out of there. No problem. Dakota tries to eat the Raider, but the Raider runs way too fast. The Spirit Walker. Never mind. The Blade Master decides to go for Dakota instead. The Shadow Hunter now under attack for the other player. And he has Stomp, offensive Stomp. And this Shadow Hunter uh, uses a healing potion as well and a healing wave thing. No, no healing potion, just healing wave, I think. Blade Master here it needs a healing wave there. Gets it. Level 5 Shadow Hunter is so strong. Uh, he kills the Kodo. He still has one more Kodo for the plus 20% uh, uh, bonus damage. The Shadow Hunter now under a lot of pressure. Blade Master, can he get her? No, he uses that healing wave just in time. Another Spirit Walker going down here. It's, these guys are still adept, they cannot refresh each other. And Lin G's out, and as you guys were saying, fly easy, peasy win for fly.